Hello and welcome to 5 Minute Math. Today we are looking at the 5th grade concept of stem and leaf plots, specifically how we can solve 1 and 2 step problems using that information and we will do it in 5 minutes or less. So we have a basic stem and leaf plot here and it records the number of inches that an airplane flies when a student is repeatedly throwing the airplane. And so we see our key here is going to be this stem area right here on the left side of the vertical line is going to be the tens place. And the leaf is going to be the ones place. So a 1 on the stem and a 7 in the leaf is going to equal 17. Let's look at a few problems. So our first question asks, how many throws were more than 20 inches? Well, the 20 inches is going to start right here in this 2 stem. And so we've got 1, 2, 3, 4 throws that were 20 inches to 29 inches. And we have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We're going to have to add 5 more throws that were 30 or more inches. So we have a total of 9 throws that were 20 or more inches. 4 in the 20s, 5 in the 30s. What is the sum of the shortest and longest throw? Well, your shortest throw is right here. And that 0, 2, that's simply going to be a 2. And that 3 and that 9, that's going to be 39. So 2 plus 39, that's going to get us 41 inches. What is the mean? Mean means average of the throws less than 10 inches. Well, we have three throws less than 10 inches. 1, 2, 3. So the way we calculate mean or average is you total those up so... 2 plus 4 plus 6. It's going to make 12. And then you divide it by how many numbers you had. So we had three numbers. So 12 over 3, 12 divided by 3, that's going to give us an average or a mean of 4 inches. If the fourth shortest throw were repeated three times, what would be the total for those four rows? Well, the fourth shortest throw shortest throw, you start from our shortest throw, 2 inches, and we count up 1, 2, 3, 4. So here's our fourth shortest throw, and that's 17. So we need to multiply 17 inches times 4, and that's just a simple multiplication problem. That's going to be 28. Here are the 2, that is 68. So the sum of 17 times 4 is going to be 68 inches. And now, what is the difference? That means subtract between the second longest throw and the second shortest throw. Well, the second longest throw is right here. That's going to be 35 inches. Second shortest is right here. That's going to be 4 inches. So 35 minus 4, that's going to be 31 inches. And now it's time for you to try. We have the same questions for your practice problem, but a new stem and leaf plot. Make sure you keep track of our key over here. 2 and the vertical line 3, that equals 23. When you have your answers, unpause your video and check your work. First, we're looking at how many throws from more than 20 inches. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. What is the sum of the shortest and the longest throw? Well, you've got 2 inches and 49 inches, so that's going to be 51 inches. Now, when you look at the mean of the throws less than 10 inches, we're looking at this row right here. When you add up 2, 3, 5, 4, and 4, that is going to give you a total of 18 divided by 5 numbers. So that's going to be 18 over 5. To figure out what that is, we're going to divide 5 into 18. That's going to go 3. Add a decimal here, and that's going to be 3.6. So our mean or average is going to be 3.6 inches. What is the fourth shortest throw repeated three times? What would be the total? One, two, three, four. It's going to be four right there. So four times four makes 16 inches. And what is the difference between the second longest throw and the second shortest throw? It's going to be 49 inches minus three going to give us 46 inches.